Okay, so this is the song If I Should Fall Behind by Bruce Springsteen for my students, uh, following on from the actual class session that we did. Um, our key is D, which could be done without the capo in a D position, but we're doing a capo to C. And the reason that is D is C would be there without the capo. If we put the capo on the first fret, it would become C sharp. And if we put the capo on the second fret, it becomes D. Simple. Okay. Bruce Springsteen doesn't play it that way when he plays it live. He uses D shapes. So we're looking at the album version, which is, in my opinion, capo 2 and C shapes. Our chords, therefore, are C, A minor, and F. Very simple song. Now, when we're doing those, if you're playing a simple C chord like this, try and do it more like this. Now, what I've done there is I've taken the C note from the fifth string and I've lifted this third finger up and put it on the sixth, which is a G note. Puts a G on the bottom of the chord. And I've used my little finger to go where my third finger was on the C. So I get that shape. C with a low G. It means you can strum all six strings and sounds quite sweet. A minor needs to be strummed from the fifth string, not the sixth, because that's not A minor. Okay, so in order to help you do that, you can use your thumb over the top of the neck, not to hold anything down, but to just simply mute the sixth string so that when you strum all strings, as I'm doing there, what you hear is the dominant A note, not the open E note. And lastly, our F chord, which is a simple four string chord, in which case it should be strummed from the fourth string, because you don't want the open fifth or open sixth, or you can do the C trick and take your finger off the fourth string there, which is an F note, bring it upwards and put it on the fifth string, which is a C note, and use your little finger to replace the third for the F note, and you get an F. It's like that from the fifth string. And if you can do that, you're really almost at doing a full gripped chord, which means you can take your thumb, put it over the top of the neck, and get the bass F, and then you've got all six strings. And that's going to be the best. So I'm going to start with the tuition from there. C like that. A minor like that. Notice how I'm using the thumb as a mute. And F like that. Notice I'm doing a full six string F chord. If you're not sure, go back over the video. Okay. Now, what I'm going to show you to just complete this part of the, uh, of the tuition, and then I'll do a second video, is how we strum. So the strum pattern needs to be, take two chords and do a pattern for those two chords, and then the next two chords, repeat that pattern. So let's look at the intro. The intro's got four bars of C. Let's take the first two bars of C. This is how it will be done. First bar of C will be done this way. And second bar of C will be done this way. Now what was the difference? Well they're both 1, 2 and 3 and 4 and means there's no and upbeat after the 1. 1, 2 and 3 and 4 and. But in the first chord we're emphasising the 1 and we're emphasising the and, 4 and. Remember numbers go down. And go up. So watch it again. This first chord in the pattern of C uh, is one, two, and three, and four, and. And where I'm shouting those and four and uh, and four and things is where you want to emphasise. So watch it again. Watch one, two, and three, and four, and. And if I do it without counting and just really emphasise it, you'll hear it. Listen. second bar of C in this case is just one, two and three and four and with the same weight. Now when I do that, listen to how it works nicely. I'll do the first part of the song and sing quietly over it. We said we'd walk together. Baby, come what may. That come the twilight. So that's what we want to do with that. First chord in the two chord pattern, and repeat it all through the song, is one heavily, two and three, and four and heavily. And then the second bar is just normal strumming of one, two and three and four and. 
So master that, and then look at the second video.